Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another one of our videos. This is day three of us being quarantined. I read that the Homeland Security is trying to mobilize the National Guard, which means they're trying to spread out the military all around the US, trying to get this place locked down and just like prepare for riots and stuff like that. <laughs> Coronavirus! So right now I'm going to Wegmans and just get the amount that I'm allowed to get. <laughs> I'm vlogging this just to show like the people that can't get outside right now that they're actually on lockdown like the people in Italy I'm pretty sure the people in London and just like anywhere else like I'm just vlogging this for you guys Like if you don't have anything to watch at home I got you guys and just trying to like give you guys the ease of mind because right now people are freaking out and They're panicking and that's not what we need right now Everyone just needs to have a peace of mind and just like pull this together like we got this I got a haircut too by the way, but right now I just don't feel like doing my hair and it's raining outside So uh, let's head out gotta change battery for the camera and let's roll out Okay, so right now I'm having a hard time finding my freaking wallet I don't know where I left my wallet last but also a lot of people do I know that they push back taxes 90 days So that helps out for me actually because I didn't even do my taxes yet Because <laughs> I had to wait for like five different W2 in the last video someone compared this virus to 9-11 Like how do you compare a virus to a terrorist attack? Like those are two completely different things You also want to know why this is a wide pandemic right now is because we have idiots like the people in Florida right now that are partying it up not listening to the CDC the CDC themselves said like don't go out in public They said don't go out to events that have 10 or more people and people are doing the complete opposite of it So no shit Obviously, this is probably gonna be one of the biggest spreads because people are purposely trying to spread it there's idiots out there are doing this like you guys don't see these there's a girl that was infected with the coronavirus that was spitting on elevator buttons like obviously a bunch of people are gonna be touching that shit so that's the problem it's the people people are just disgusting there's some more bread now finally we actually have some wipes here so yo comment down below if anyone needs wipes like let me know like i'm more than willing to send you guys some it's pretty early right now so it looks like they kind of stocked up so i'm gonna get a quite a few of these so you guys let me know if you guys need some wipes comment down below I'll be more than happy to ship you guys some. Okay, so the main question now is do they have hand sanitizer? So let's go find out. You know what's crazy? St. Patrick's Day was Tuesday and I didn't even notice because no one was posting it on uh, social media. That's how I usually find out about the holidays is when someone posts it. Alright, so I got the four packs of baby wipes which I'm actually trying to give away two of them. That's the reason why I got them because uh, I had some people DM me saying that they wanted some baby wipes. Or they needed some baby wipes because they couldn't get any where they were. And I just really felt sad for them. Got two packs of these shrimps, got the latex gloves. Surprisingly, this was the last one. And then got two things of bread. Also, we have these meats in here. I got I got pork chop, I got chicken wings, I got chicken thighs. So, pretty set on meats for now. My mom came through and got us some diapers and wipes. Look at all this. And Thank you, mama. It's 99% water. What is it? Now? I don't think this one says it. Yeah, it is. Where does it say it? It says it's a skin. Yeah, no, like 99% water. Where? Oh, yeah, 99% water. But it's like sensitive skin. Yeah, we didn't need wipes, but we'll Five take dollars. them. <laughs> Four dollars. Four for the, each? Five dollars. Mar divers. Wait, so this number on here doesn't mean for the month. Like, sometimes it does. I, I go by it because for Kyle, because right now he's one month and he fits into the one month diaper, so, so I go by it. I mean, that's what I thought it was. Like, I'm a new father here, my bad. You open it? What? This? Which one? Oh, you can't open it? Yeah, open it. Oh. What, what is this? This for the family. Oh. Medicine. You feed him at all day? Oh. No. no. Oh. What is this? Smell it. Vanilla ex extract? <laughs> what is it? No, that's medicine. Oh. <laughs> you guys stomach ache, he put a little bit on his tummy. So uh -huh. I just massage it on his belly a little bit? Yeah. You can use this too. I can oh, put... Oh, I know what this is. Put that on my butt? We have it in Peru. It's that same smell. They use it when you're like sore. They rub it on you. Yeah. Are you talking about Vicks? On the tummy, on the tummy too. For the baby, you can use that too. Are you talking talking about the Vicks? No, not Vicks. <laughs> like Hispanic and Filipino moms yeah. think that Vicks fix everything. Kylan's awake. Oh, baby. Oh, it's like Kylan. Kylan, guess who's here? Hi. Come on, baby. Oh, okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, 
He probably does need a diaper change. He was just sitting next to me watching me play the game. We have an appointment for Erica. She has to get a shot in her booty for, was it the birth control? Yeah, it's like a depo shot. Yeah, so uh, we have no choice to bring Kylan because we have no milk right now that Erica pumped. So Erica's the only option for it. Kylan to eat. Kylan and I are just gonna stay in the car while Erica goes into the hospital and gets her shot. I wanna show them Kylan. Look at our baby boy. And it's so nice now. Oh my God. And plus we have our alcohol wipes, so don't come at us. Mmm, look at that snack right there. Mmm. Hey, hey, excuse me, miss. Can I get your number? I don't care, I ain't asked for all that. Okay, TikToker. See, told you guys Kyla and I are just waiting in the car. We're not gonna take him out. We got you guys, like, we're not risking anything. Don't you guys worry. It is 87 degrees right now. Your boy might go to the beach, like, just tan. Like, look at my skin, guys. Like, my complexion right now, I look like a ghost. Like, when I get tan, though, I get that sexy, like, you know, that, mm, that lip biting tan. You guys know what I'm talking about? Hi, baby. He's awake. Look how cute he looks. And Well, he looks cute with everything, but... I think light blue is his color. Is that teal? I don't know. Oh baby. Guys, his eyes too. Look, you guys tell me what color are his eyes? Like, look, let me get closer. I think his eyes are brown. Right? What color are your eyes, baby? Hmm? Where's your mama? Huh? Where's your mama? Your mama's going to get birth control so we don't have a brother or sister. Or are we? You, you want to say hi to everyone? Baby, say hi. Guys, he's getting so chunky. Look at them cheeks. What's wrong, baby? Oh. You sleepy? What's wrong? He's sleepy. Okay. So Eric and I have been talking and we were talking about like having another kid. It's like right now we want to have a house when we have our second kid because it's gonna get crazy. Like just our experience from having Kylan, like it, it's tough. I'm not gonna lie, like parenting is hard. We're probably gonna see ourselves living at this apartment that we're at now, maybe for like two years, maybe three, who knows exactly because we want to find like the right house for us. We just want to make sure like we're financially stable to get a house and all that. So we just want our kids to all have their own room and just like, you know, live it up and just be the best parents that we can for them. Now she wanna touch my body, that's on me, that's on me. Now she wanna touch my body. Hey. Hey yo Ma, get in the car. Yeah, you. Hey yo, get in the get in the car. Damn, yo, this fine Latina getting in my car, yo. Hold up, hold up. Can I get a ride? Yeah, for sure. I mean, come on in. Thanks. I mean, what what you doing out here all alone, you know? I oh, you know. Just I don't, that's why I ask. I don't need all that attitude. So, uh, what's your name? Uh, Erica. Oh, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but you mind putting your seatbelt on? You yeah, know? Sure. I'm all about that safety, you know? Alright, so I got a kid in the back, is that cool? Uh, I don't know. You all about that, like, mom life? I mean, I can be. Yeah, I mean, I was waiting here for, like, the baby mama, but, like, you know, she got hella annoying, so... <gasps> I was trying to get rid of her. Alright. <laughs> I'm just joking. I love you. Give me a kiss. <laughs> I did they were gonna do the depot shot in my butt, but she asked if I wanted it in my hip or in my arm, and I said in my arm, and she did in my arm, and she said it normally hurts, but it didn't hurt, so I'm happy. Dang, okay, they injected a freaking tracking chip in your arm. Okay. Uh -huh. Yo, guys, look at this. So we didn't see this before, but they're doing the... Uh, they're testing right now. This is like a drive through testing for the coronavirus. I think they're doing like the swabs over here. This is crazy. This is like some end of, the, end of the world type shit. Coronavirus! I am so sorry guys, I forgot to vlog this for you, but I'm making that shrimp and steak dish, but now I'm kind of modifying it a little bit. So he learned from me. Lies. But anyways, as we were rudely interrupted by the stranger that I picked up at the hospital, I added mushrooms this time and I put some thyme in it as well, just to give it a little bit more flavor. But so basically you want to saute the shrimp with some butter and garlic on the side, same thing with the mushrooms. And then you want to combine those together, chop up some tomatoes, put that in here with heavy whipping cream. And then I added uh, the thyme just for extra flavor, salt, pepper. Cook the steak to the side to your liking. It's not fully cooked here because I'm gonna put it in here to cook even more. As soon as this simmers up and gets the flavor with the thyme and everything, that's when I'm gonna add the steak. You can do it with noodles like Erica's doing, but I'm on a strict keto diet with like no carbs. So that's why I'm doing this with no noodles. Highland's in such a good mood. Like, look at him. You're such in a, you're in such a good mood, baby. You happy? 
<laughs> yeah, as soon as we start eating, Erica was saying that, like, as soon as we take a bite of our food, that's when we just start crying. See? He started crying as soon as we started eating. Look. We just started eating. <laughs> He's just mad because he can't eat it too. So situations like this, one of us would usually watch Conan while the other person eats. So I'm gonna let Erica eat this time because last time she did it for me. It's a couple days later. We just been like doing a lot of quarantine stuff, but it's really hard to get vlog content. I mean, even though we vlog from home anyways, it's just hard to think of stuff right now with everything that's going on in the world. But right now we're giving Kylan some tummy time. <laughs> Yeah, look, all that is his jewel. <laughs> or is it? Erica Loki peed the bed. It's okay, baby, you got it. You, you need to be, you need to strengthen your back, baby. He's been doing this for like 10 minutes. I think he's just over it at this point. Yeah, baby, mama is gonna feed you. He moved a lot though. He started like right here. Yeah. Okay, okay. You done? Time to eat now? Okay, Chucky. You're doing good though. He lifted his head like pretty high up. He was like right here. Just looking around. <laughs> it's okay, Poopy. It's okay. We're not doing this to torture you. <laughs> okay, I did that flip you over. Dang boy, you made it up. I'm really wet here. Okay, okay. okay. There we go. Oh my god. Okay. okay. I know it's time. It's time to eat. So I'm sitting here editing right now, and then Eric asked me if Kylan's eyes are open, and I look over. He's staring right at me. <laughs> Hi, baby. God, look how big he is compared to Erica. Guys, look. He's so big. That's his first time wearing that, and he's already like outgrowing it. Say hi. Say hi, baby. It is the next day, and uh, my babies and I are going to work out at Mount Trashmore. Or Erica's gonna watch me work out. I brought my snack to watch you. <laughs> Both of our parents are currently here, so Kylan is fully fed. So we're gonna take advantage of this and go work out because we've been stuck inside for the longest time. And I also got my kettlebell, so let's go. Cards on the table, your turn to play We can't turn back now, we know how this will go It's so sad that I'm leaving, I just don't see no other way And it seems like you feel the same Could have had everything, but you had to go and mess it all up Whatever you want me to do, yeah you know that I I won't Everything's different, I know how this will go I'm so sorry for leaving, I can't even believe it Maybe we'll meet again Could've had everything, but you had to go and mess it all up Whatever you want me to do, yeah you know that I I won't do that When you're saying those things to me Keep on making me miss end the workout with some TikTok moves because that's a good workout, guys. Our vacation's over. Let's go back home. I still have this random girl from the hospital, dude. That's crazy. Let's do the TikTok move, buddy. Dodge family. Yeah, you hit the dab. You have to do the dab again. <laughs> hey. 
Oh, <laughs> your dad's cool. Look at you go. Ready? Old people still got it. They do. He knows about TikTok. He's not old at all. You want to see a Michael Jackson move? Yeah. <laughs> Just like a dad who likes to embarrass the kids. And nah, really kids, kids need that though. Look what Erica's parents brought. They brought all this shit. The grandmas are chilling here too. Stocked up. This vlog is like all over the place, but I forgot to mention that I got an air fryer for us as well. Here it is. Ta-da, I cannot wait to use this. I'm actually gonna use this tonight. I'm not sure if it's gonna be in this vlog, but uh, Erica made some bacon, but she did it that way. But I heard that you can actually cook bacon in this as well. And this thing was like almost $300. You can cook a lot of stuff in this. I'm not sure exactly how to use it yet, but I can't wait to use this like to actually make a whole like rotisserie chicken. Like Erica was even telling me that we can do like a Peruvian style Peruvian chicken. Yeah, so I can't wait for that. So like you stab both sides of the chicken and it actually rotates inside of it. Still not sure what this is for. This came with it. I don't know if you put the wings in here or something. I don't know. But the main reason I got this is because I, I heard that it used some kind of grease. Like you got to use some grease still. But we're tired of using like grease like this because we feel like it's getting everywhere. Like the house is starting to smell like grease. And the house smells. It's like a full on cleaning process. Like Every morning. Yeah, we're tired of like cleaning up the top too here because it gets really greasy and then like the microwave gets greasy. And Kylan's sitting here just being a good boy now. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Today we're just going to probably chill in bed, watch movies, hang out with Kylan, and eat some good food. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And if you are, turn your post notifications on so you get notified every single time we post a new video. Hope everyone's staying safe and in their homes and uh, just trying to stay as healthy as possible. Bye!